something good in names from Elstree, but this time they don't belong to film stars, just commoner garden bus routes. Here, the black backgrounds are being rolled in for bus destination blinds at a London transport maintenance depot. It's a topsy-turvy affair, this business of bus signs, for it's only the parts they don't paint that you can read. The shapes of the letters are left clear so that light can pass through them. It's a case of the longer the name, the less ink they need. Fifty thousand blinds have to be maintained, which keeps Arthur Bannum and his pals busy indeed. With over 600 routes to serve, they can't risk a mix-up on names. They'd be the target for some well-merited grumbles if they gummed up the wrong ones. Over now to the tailoring department, where the linen back rolls are neatly hemmed up. London's newest buses carry seven blinds each, so that they can be easily switched from one route to another at short notice. Short, did I say? Nine yards long, it's like a blink and roll call. Pity they don't always trail them like this, then they could speed past the request stops towing their queues. Mm -hmm. 